welcome back. I'm joined now by our very own Maya Hudgens and Jared Floyd, co-host of tonight's St. Jude Dream Home Giveaway. Very exciting, the moment we've been waiting for for months. Mm. Uh, Jared, what can we expect to see tonight? Well, we're going to be giving away some amazing prizes. Obviously, this year's St. Jude Dream Home uh, being built by Braco Construction is the highlight of uh, this year's uh, showcase, if you will, of just the talents of this community. Uh, so from 6 to 7 p.m. tonight on NBC 10 and Fox 14, uh, we'll be giving away some amazing prizes, celebrating what this community has done for the kids and the families mm -hmm. of St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. And like I said, somebody is going to be winning a home that's located at 204 Maison Drive, and, and it is spectacular. How exciting. Mm -hmm. And tell us about some of the other prizes that are being drawn tonight. Of course, we have a $2,500 Visa gift card uh, from Assurance Financial. Mm -hmm. We have a 2023 Mazda sedan wow. uh, from Dream Day Foundation. We have a lawn care package and a lawnmower from 3B Outdoors. Um, and of course, $10,000 in uh, services and furniture from Sleepy Hollow. So a lot of cool prizes mm -hmm. coming up. I wish I could win one of them. Amazing <laughs> prizes <laughs> and, and an amazing house. For those who have not seen the house, give us some information about the features, the location, and the size of it. Right, so it's in uh, Frenchman's Bend, 204 Maison Drive. It's right off the 11th fairway. Uh, golf balls, you would have to hit a really bad shot to hit uh -huh. this home. Uh, <laughs> I've, I have come close, but not that far. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's uh, an amazing home value of $400,000. It's got that hidden pantry again. Oh, so if you so if cool. you go in and, and check out the house or when you win it today, hopefully, uh, you can check that out as well. Uh, just it, It's staged beautifully designed. Uh, Jan did a great job this year. Uh, Bradley and Brian and all the folks at Braco and, and the subcontractors, they just do an amazing job work with it every year and so like I said if you missed out on the tours uh, you missed out on a treat and hopefully this is your your night to win the home because it, it is spectacular and all the money that is raised for the home goes towards such a great cause and I'm gonna let you tell us about that yeah it's a really really cool and um, I don't think I've ever thought before working here at the station like that I'd be able to play such a big hand in helping mm -hmm. families and children who um, are going through some of the most devastating maybe season of their life that they're ever going to go through. And so being able to play just this tiny little hand in it and where and bringing awareness to um, what's happening in our community and what's happening here in Louisiana to families here, not just in Louisiana, but across the country. Um, just being a small part in that just brings me so much joy and just really tough at my heartstrings, yeah. so I enjoy being a part of this. And even though we might not be able to buy a ticket and pay that way, but being able to encourage our audience and to highlight what St. Jude does um, is just such an honor. And Jared, I want you to piggyback after mm -hmm. the, that. You have stayed up all night. You've had mm -hmm. the uh, St. Jude-a-thon. I mean, right. you played a big hand in this as well. What has this experience been like for you? Well, I, I think it's just a treat for the entire community. We all have our own um, ways of contributing. And if I can talk for 24 hours and, and sell and, and reserve tickets that's great but there are our subcontractors our contractors mm -hmm. our donors all these people that they have their talents and it's just, this is just our way every year of putting those talents together for something successful to to help raise $850,000, nearly a million dollars for St. Jude Children's Guys, Research Thank Hospital. you so much. I look forward to tonight. The drawing is at 6 o'clock yep. on KTVE and right here on Fox 14. And coming up next on Louisiana Living, be sure to tune in tonight. As we said, we'll sit down with Dr. Avius Carroll with the Northeast Delta Human Services Authority. That's after the break. Stay with us.